everybody, it's Jen from Scrapping Posh and I am here today with a mini album share and this is using Echo Park's A Dog's Tale and this is a country craft creation design team project. So hop on over and grab this. This is the second mini that I made out of this collection. So let me get the other one so you can see. So out of one collection, I made this 8x8 mini, and I'll link this below, and then I made this, like, I think it's like a 4 and 3 quarter by 6 and 3 quarter, and I, the reason why I made this one is because I had a lot of the cut aparts left, so this is to showcase the cut apart. So this one, I think, is a more masculine album, and I think this one may be like more feminine and let me show you before I start what I have left out of the whole collection um, I, I did have the the sticker sheet and I had two collections and then some um, authentic papers um, I will link everything that I had in the box below so I have just a few stickers left over from the 12 by 12 sticker sheet um, which I will use probably like a project life layout I made um, some cards with the scraps and the stickers. So one, two, three, four, five. Because, you know, you. So I made six cards. But you sometimes you need cards and it's not a holiday, so six cards I got done that's not bad and then this is all the paper that I have left and I didn't throw anything away that wasn't under um like one inch so everything else was teeny tiny and I tossed those but this there's still some cut aparts in here perfect for project life that I'm really far behind on. <laughs> so yeah, so this is everything I have left out of the collection and my projects that I made. Now let's do the share real quick on this. Um, it has a ribbon closure seam binding and that is available at Country Craft Creations. I will link that below. Um, it's just a cut apart on the front with two little heart stickers, um, two stickers on the spine. It's a two inch spine. And then I use the um, tag paper on the back. And every page is the same. So there's going to be a tutorial for this. It's going to be a really short tutorial because the pages are like one page. I'll do the cover, the, the, the spine, the hinge, and one page. And then I'll decorate the rest with you, but it'll all be in time lapse with music. So, um, But every, <clears throat> almost every uh, front page here has a 4x6 cut apart. And then plain paper on the inside. You have a three and three quarter by six and a half tag, so plenty of room for photos in here. The sticker says the cat did it. I, I had to use it. And then there's a little pocket in the back. There's a four by four cut apart here. And then I stuck the three by fours in the pocket. So use all your cut aparts. Let's take these out as I go through. There we go. Add these cute sticker, this dog and this big chair. Another sticker here on this photo mat or this uh, 4x6. Okay. And then a 4x4 cut apart here. Like I said, it's the same page design over and over again. It's almost the easiest way to guarantee that you'll be able to use the cut aparts that you have because they're the same size. They're all consistently the same size. Sticker on that one. So you have a good place for a 4x4 here or a 3x2, <clears throat> possibly a 3x2 and then a 3x2 this way. But um, on the ones that don't have the stickers on it, you have uh, cute. You have room for a four by six, 
like this it is a perfect space for a four by six. This uh, mat is four and a quarter by six and a quarter. So you have room for a whole four by six picture right there. There's that dog again on that chair. I think it's hilarious. And this is a four by six, obviously, because it's a four by six cut apart. So you'd have to trim a half inch off your photos to make just like a quarter inch, but it would still be super cute. So it's, I, I, I like the size of the album, but mostly I just wanted to display these cut aparts. And it's super simple. Super simple, super, super fast. I think I did this whole album in like three hours. All right, so there you go. This, uh, the entire album measures seven by four and three quarter with a two inch spine. And we'll put the video or the tutorial will be up tomorrow. So I thank everybody for watching. Um, hop on over to Country Craft Creations to grab this paper collection and the sticker sheet. Um, I think in total if you wanted to do all these projects it would be um, in my cards I did two paper collections, one, one of the sticker sheets and then um, some authentic solids but you can always substitute for solids that you have um, already in your stash so super cute paper line for dog lovers all right everybody have a great day uh, like comment and subscribe i'd appreciate it and have a great day bye, -bye.